Hi, this is Brandon from Aramax. Today we're repairing an RP25 quarter horsepower single piston compressor. The tools we will be using to repair this unit are 532nd Allen wrench, 8th inch Allen wrench, a flathead screwdriver, and a small pick tool. Included with this maintenance kit are piston cup, o-ring gasket, cylinder gasket, cylinder sleeve, two leaf valves, and four screws are included with this kit, but the two with the Torx head you will not be using. First, use a 532nd Allen wrench to remove the four screws holding down the cylinder head. Next, remove the cylinder head, followed by the valve plate and set to the side. Remove and discard the old cylinder sleeve. Next, use an eighth inch Allen wrench to remove the two screws on the piston cup. Remove and discard the worn piston cup and install the new one from the maintenance kit. Next, firmly push the piston cup into the cylinder sleeve. Flip over to ensure the piston cup is evenly aligned. Reinstall the cylinder sleeve onto the piston and line up the holes. Use two new screws from your maintenance kit to reinstall your piston cup using an 8 inch Allen wrench. Tighten firmly, but be sure not to over tighten. Next, we need to remove the leaf valves. Take the valve plate from the cylinder head and remove the screw holding the leaf valves using a flathead screwdriver. Save the screw in the leaf valve retainer, but replace the two old leaf valves with the two new ones from your maintenance kit. When installing the leaf valves, ensure the leaf valve and retainer are located on the opposite side of the O-ring. Place the leaf valve with the retainer in the U-shaped groove on the head cover and place over the hole. When installing the retainer, ensure the curved portion of the retainer rests on the leaf valve. While holding the leaf valve and retainer in place, on the reverse side, line up the second leaf valve to cover the opposite hole. Place the screw and secure the leaf valves into place. Ensure the leaf valves completely cover the holes in the valve plate and that they are not covering the same hole. Next, remove the old O-ring using a small pick tool and install a new one from the maintenance kit. Flip the valve plate back onto the cylinder. Next, remove the old gasket and install the new one from the maintenance kit. Place the head cover back onto the cylinder head. Ensure everything is aligned properly. Reinstall the four screws using a 532nd Allen wrench onto the compressor to secure the cylinder head. The recommended torque for the screws is between 33 and 36 inch-pounds. If you do not have an inch-pound torque wrench available, tighten the screws firmly with your Allen wrench. After completing the maintenance kit installation, this is the perfect time to replace the air filter. We recommend this to be done every three to six months. Simply hold the base of the air filter and turn the top clockwise to remove the air filter cap. Replace the old air filter with a new one. This is Brandon from Aramax. Today we just completed the RP25 quarter horsepower maintenance kit. For more information, contact your local dealer or visit us online at aramaxeco.com.